of the church of God. Faith. What does faith offer you? Life everlasting. If then you desire to enter into life, keep the commandments. Thou shalt love the Lord thy God with all thy whole heart, and with all with thy whole soul, and with thy whole mind, and thy neighbor as thyself. Go forth from him. Go, go forth from him, unclean spirit, and give place to the Holy Spirit, the Paraclete. Receive the sign of the cross, both upon your forehead and also upon your heart. Take to you the faith of the heavenly precepts, and so order your life as to be as to be from henceforth the temple of God. Let us pray mercifully. Hear our prayer. Our prayers we beseech thee, O Lord, and by thy perpetual assistance keep this thine elect James signed with the sign of the Lord's cross, so that preserving this first experience of the greatness of thy glory, he may deserve by keeping thy commandments to attain the glory of regeneration through Christ our Lord. Amen. Let us pray. Almighty everlasting God, Father of our Lord Jesus Christ, look graciously down upon this thy servant, James, whom thou hast graciously called into the beginnings of the faith. Drive out from him all blindness of heart, break all the toils of Satan, wherewith he was held. Open unto him, O Lord, the gate of thy loving kindness, that being impressed with the sign of thy wisdom, he may be free from the foulness of all wicked desires and in the sweet order, order of thy precepts may joyfully serve thee in thy church and grow in grace from day to day through the same Christ our Lord. Amen. Amen. God's creature, salt, I cast out the demon from you in the name of God the Father, in the love of our Lord Jesus Christ, and in the strength of the Holy Spirit. I purify you by the living God, the true God, the holy God, by God who created you to be a preservative for mankind and ordered you to be sanctified by his ministers to, be, to, to the benefit of the people who are about to embrace the faith. In the name of the blessed Trinity, may you become the saving sign and power to drive away the enemy. Therefore, we beg you, Lord our God, to sanctify and bless to bless this creature salt thou thus providing a perfect remedy for all who receive it one that will permeate their inmost being we ask this in the name of our lord jesus christ who is coming to judge both the living and the dead and the world by fire amen <coughs> Mm. 
Receive the salt of wisdom. <laughs> Receive the salt of wisdom. Let it be to thee a token of mercy unto everlasting life. Amen. Peace be with you and with your spirit. Let us pray. O God of our fathers, O God, the author of all truth, for saith we humbly beseech thee to look graciously down upon this thy servant James, and as he tastes this first nutriment of salt, suffer him no longer to hunger for want of heavenly food, to the end that he may be always fervent in spirit, rejoicing in hope, always serving thy name. Lead him, O Lord, we beseech thee to the lover of the new regeneration, that together with thy faithful, he may deserve to attain the everlasting rewards of thy promises through Christ our Lord. Amen. Amen. I exercise thee of Queen Spirit in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit that thou goest out and depart from this servant of God, James, for he commands thee a cursed one who walked upon the sea and stretched out his hand to Peter about to sin. Therefore, a cursed evil, a cursed evil, Acknowledge thy sentence and give honor to the living and the true God. Give honor to Jesus Christ, his Son, and to the Holy Spirit. And depart from this servant of God, James, because God and our Lord Jesus Christ have but sent to him to call him to his holy grace and benediction and to the font of baptism. And this sign of the Holy, <coughs> Holy Cross, which we make upon his forehead, do thou accost evil, never dare to violate, through the same Christ our Lord. Amen. 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 Let us pray. O Holy Lord, Father Almighty, eternal God, author of life and truth, I implore thy everlasting and most just goodness upon this thy servant James, that thou wouldest but chase, but save to enlighten him with the light of thy wisdom. Cleanse him and sanctify him. Give unto him true knowledge, that being made worthy of the grace of the baptism, he may hold firm firm hope, right counsel, and holy doctrine through Christ our Lord. Amen. James, enter thou into the temple of God, that thou mayest have power with Christ unto life everlasting. Amen. Right. I 
I believe in the Lord God, the Father Almighty, Creator of heaven and earth, and in Jesus Christ, His only Son, our Lord, who was conceived by the Holy Spirit, born of the Virgin Mary, suffered under Pontius Pilate, was crucified, died, and was buried. He descended into hell. On the third day, He rose again from the dead. He descended into heaven and is seated at the right hand of the Father. Thank you. 